Hey folks, Justin from Tackle Tactics. Today on the Tackle Tactics Animated Knot Series, we are stepping through the Rapala Knot. So the Rapala Knot is a loop knot. It can be a bit trickier to tie than some of the other loop knots, but it's been proven to test the strongest in terms of loop knot options for anglers. So ideal for attaching a lure, fly or a hook, allowing freedom of movement. The only downside of the Rapala knot is that when the knot is complete, the tag end points forward, which some anglers don't like because it can pick up weed and other debris in the water. So some anglers do prefer the lefties loop knot or other options in the loop knots that are available. Let's step through the Rapala knot. We commence our Rapala knot by creating a basic overhand knot, leaving a reasonable length on the tag end. Pass the tag end through the eye of the lure, fly or hook then pass it from front to back through the loop of the overhand knot. You can now begin twisting the tag end around the main line. Complete at least three twists. You can now pass the tag end back through the loop on the overhand knot as shown from back to front. Moisten the knot and slowly start tightening it down, ensuring the twists bed down evenly and the end loop is the desired size. You can now pull the main line and tag end to fully tighten the knot, trim off the tag end neatly, and the Rapala knot is ready to fish. So there you go, folks, there is the Rapala knot. As we said, a little bit trickier to tie than some of the other loop knots, but it is the one that does test the strongest if you're going up against big fish, which hopefully you are. Get out there, get stuck into a few. Cheers.